Hey YouTube, it's Alicia Burton here and I want to come and try to uh, explain how I do my wrapping method when I wash my hair and um, I'm going to kind of sort of give you a run through including products right quick before I go out to my mom's house and stuff but yeah so when I wash my hair I use the Lada Body with coconut and she or hydrating me moisturizing shampoo this is the 10.1 fluid ounce right here and this is for all types of hair i like it and yeah so then the next one excuse me that i use is the lot of body with coconut and she or hydrating me moisturizing conditioner 10.1 fluid ounce as well conditioner and it keeps my hair soft so once i done that and wash it i brush it i comb it and i brush it i go and comb it with the wrap tube comb but then with my longer pieces i do a pull comb method where i take it through and i pull comb it like this and that's with this wide tooth comb with the rat tail on, on the end so yes that's it so i use two different brushes so this is the thicker brush i use to slick everything down to make sure it stays down now with the lighter brush i just light up uh, way heavy-handed i just like i'm um, kind of like making sure it stays slicked down and everything with it now um when it comes to my edging gel, the edging gel I do use, but once I do all of my combing and pre while it's still wet, I'm, so the one I'm using tonight is the Gold Liquid um, Cream of Nature with Argan Oil from my um, Morocco, and it's the Style and Shine um, Foaming Mousse. So yeah, this is the one right here. And um, I'm going to give you a review on that. That's the one thing I do want to do. So then when it comes to, like I said, the edging gel, the ones that I use is the following. The, oh, let me make sure I pronounce this correctly. ORS, O-R-S, um, and it's the Olive Oil Edge Control Gel. And then I have it in the Lighter Body Coconut and Sheet Oil Edge Control Gel as well. And that is that. So once I use that and um, it completely dries. So what I will do is I take this comb right here and I will comb through it. To see how much of a bounce I have. And that will be it. And then I will take. I will just leave it like it is. Or it's right here. Uh, in, my, in this bag is my. Um, uh, flat iron. That I use to curl. This thing heats up to about 450 degrees. So ladies if you get this one. Um, it's the. Um ceramic termit sorry i can't pronounce the name red um flat iron this um heats up to about 200 um not to about 450 so this thing will get very hot um if you get this one i gotta get one i say go and find a thick a get a thick find a thick curling iron tight glove for you can use because this thing gets uh, gets very heated and i always have to be careful with this but yeah this is i think a one and a half inch or one inch but yeah so let me before I, so there you go and i got this at, this curling on at walmart for about $14.59. I mean, not for $14.59. That's not too bad. And, yeah, and I keep it up in this right here. But, yeah. So, yeah, that is it. 
I have a lot of hair products um, I will be trying to use for you. And when it warms up a little more, I will let y'all see my natural hair at its natural state. I do wear my hair natural in the summertime, coming up to the summertime. But if it can, like, you know, the warmness comes down and stuff like that, I think I'll be okay. But until then, I'm Alicia Burton. Don't forget to thumbs up this video, comment below, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.